All right, guys, Georgia Boy here with just a short video on marbles. The Marbles Company. Uh, a lot of us have heard of marbles because of their sights. Well, Webster Marbles, he was a timber forester, a timber cruiser up in Michigan in the early 1900s and quite the outdoorsman and inventor. And he invented a lot of cool stuff back in the day when things made in America were some of the best things in the world as far as quality goes. He invented, of course, the semi-buckhorn and buckhorn sights that you find on old Winchesters and Marlins and lever guns. And if you still need replacement sights, Marbles is the place to look. Uh, he, you know, of course, the tang mounted peep sight he invented a very high grade little clip on brass compass uh that's his safety axe it was a little camp hatchet that had a guard in the handle that would fold up and cover the edge of the the blade there uh, he made fixed blade knives and folding knives and just all sorts of good camping gear, hunting and fishing stuff. And the old original marbles, knives, and equipment, man, it's real collectible. It's fetching big money these days. And marbles is still around. They still make good sights. And they still make knives, even though today their knives, like everything else, are made in China. And they're good to carry you know just usable knives and if you lose them you're not out a lot of money but back in 1998 uh through 2003 i think marbles uh made a short run of uh knives made to the same quality and standards as the old ones and made them here in the u.s and uh, Gladstone, Michigan. And I've got a pretty good knife collection, so I picked up some. Uh, I got this fixed blade. Uh, one of Marble's uh, most successful fixed blade knives is what he called the ideal knife. And it comes with a good, high quality leather sheath. And uh, here's what the knife looks like. Has a stacked leather handle, the nice spacers, a genuine stag pommel, a brass finger guard, and a six inch blade with a wide, deep blood groove. It's the Marbles Ideal. And if you're looking at that, you think, wow, that looks a lot like the USMC K-Bar, the fighting knife. Well, this is the granddaddy to the K-Bar. And made in the USA. And so you'll still run across Marbles knives today. Any that were made in the U.S., it'll be stamped on the blade. Any that doesn't have it is uh, made overseas. So that was their, I think this one, I got this knife in uh, 2000. Uh, pocket knives at that same time. Let's see. I got this one. Two blade jack, red stag bone handles. Match strike pull and made in the USA, Gladstone, Michigan, 2001. And uh, just high quality, good snap. And so, even you know, the originals and these made between. I think 1998 and 2003 are fetching a pretty good premium now, but 
when you're out and about, old flea markets and stuff, state sales, and you come by some old sheath knives or pocket knives that say marbles or the safety axe or anything, man, you better, you ought to grab that stuff up. It's good quality stuff. And if you're in the need of some replacement sights for some old lever guns today or tang peeps, I'd encourage you to look to marbles. They make good stuff. Anyway, just a short video on the Marbles Company. Hope you guys have a good day.